welcome to our show. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and whatever else is left, we bring you a compound. A compound unlike any other compound. A compound made of compounded elements. We bring you... Water! Hi everyone, I'm Water, or h 2 over short. I'm made from two elements, hydrogen and oxygen. Tell us more about yourself. I am a universal solvent. I am less dense as a solid. I can do surface tension and I can hold heat very well. How are you the universal solvent? Because of my polarity, unlike my attitude or mental state, my whole body is negative except for my ears, which are positive. Therefore, I can be attracted to negative or positive molecules, ions, and covalent compounds. You see, my negative body gets attracted to the positive atoms in the ionic compound. My ears get attracted to the negative part of the compound. When that happens, I pull the ionic compounds apart. This allows me to conduct electricity, which I can't do on my own. For covalent compounds, they just stay intact, because they are polar as well as I am. As you can see, I can be attracted to anyone. So, other elements and compounds, my number is 1-800-H-2-O. Call me! <laughs> okay, what do you mean, you're less dense as a solid? Or density anomaly? It means that when I am frozen, I can float on my liquid form. There's helps in like critters in water against sharp temperature changes. What is surface tension? Because of my polarity, I can group up with my buddies and create a small wall of molecules to try to hold ourselves together. It takes a special dance I like to call cohesion. Come on, guys! Let's pull ourselves together! We can do this! Oh no! They're adding another drop! Because of surface tension, I am able to perform capillary reaction. In plants, I can reach up to the leaves and other parts of the plant to enable it to create sugar and carbon dioxide. And you can hold heat well? Why yes, I am a good for spreading heat and insulating it. Here, watch! I felt like I was burning on the inside! Because of my heat capacity, I help moderate Earth's climate and buffer temperature fluctuations. You want to see another trick? I can also vanish into thin air! This process is called evaporation! I transform from a liquid to a gas. If I'm inside a plant, this process is called transpiration. When I gain weight and condense in the air, gravity pulls me down in a process called precipitation. After falling from the sky and crashing on the land, I drain into the ground or run off to where most life gets me from. This area is known as a watershed and is very important to the environment. Especially how clean I am is important. I need to be clean in order to give plants and animals the nutrients they need. If I'm carrying something, I could even poison living things. That's why I got to be clean. Whoa! You are certainly a very special compound. Without you, water, there would be nothing in this world. There would be no support for life if you weren't involved with photosynthesis and cellular respiration. You have to be clean to support life. A truly amazing biography. That's all today, folks.